Although Hyde's automatic tracking is very powerful, it is not equally suited for all objects. In this tutorial, I will show you how to remove an object moving the mask manually. Please make sure that keyframes on the timeline are shown. To mask the object to be removed, select a mask form. The rectangle will work fine here. Make sure that the head is completely covered by the mask. Then click the green checkbox to apply the mask. Now move the timeline cursor to the next position. Move the mask and see how a keyframe is being automatically added to the timeline. Adjust the size of the mask, if necessary, and continue to the next position. Move the mask to its end position. You may now trim the end of the clip if you like to do so. Let's go back where we started and adjust the mask up to the beginning of the clip. You may also trim the start of the clip. We now move the cursor through the timeline to check if the mask covers the entire object throughout the clip. If necessary, adjust the size or position of the mask. Everything seems to look fine now. Let's check by clicking on View Result. The yellow line above the keyframes shows the growing region where the data has already been calculated for preview. And no matter where we set the cursor, the head is gone. The result is perfect. Thanks for watching and enjoy your work with Hyde.